A Republican campaign group has repeated its demand for the abolition of the monarchy shortly after Prince Harry made a series of incendiary claims about the royal family. The Duke discussed life within the firm as part of a documentary on mental health he co-hosted for Apple TV. Harry revealed he turned to drink and drugs to help cope with his mother's death and said he and Meghan's requests for help were met with total silence. He also revealed the Duchess of Sussex had discussed the practicalities of how she was going to end her life. After the five, Part series was released campaign group Republic tweeted a graphic of Prince Charles with the caption, Can't we just choose our next head of state? They accompanied this with the hashtag and the monarchy. The post was liked more than 100 times by other Twitter users. Republic is urging the UK to replace the Queen with an elected head of state. Harry Co. hosted the with US talk show legend Oprah Winfrey. It followed the bombshell interview the Sussexes gave to Ms. Winfrey in March in which they made a number of damaging accusations. Speaking on Apple TV, Harry said, I thought my family would help, but every single ask, request, warning, whatever it is, just got met with total silence, total neglect. We spent four years trying to make it work. We did everything that we possibly could to stay there and carry on doing the role and doing the job. But Meghan was struggling. Harry and Meghan caused a global sensation in January 2020 by announcing their intention to step down as senior royals. They currently live in an 11.2 million pounds Californian mansion with their son, Archie Mountbatten, Windsor. Describing the decision to step down Harry said, that feeling of being trapped within the family, there was no option to leave. Eventually when I made that decision for my family, I was still told, you can't do this. It's like well how bad does it have to get until I am allowed to do this. She, Megan, was going to end her life. It shouldn't have to get to that. This saw him breathing deeply and shutting his eyes whilst recalling traumatic events from his life. In March, Meghan claimed there were concerns and conversations within the royal family about Archie's skin tone ahead of his birth. However it added some recollections may vary about the events discussed. During the series Harry insisted he still wants reconciliation and healing with the wider royal family. If you need to speak to someone, contact mine.org.uk or call Samaritans for free on 116 123 or email joe at samaritans.org.